Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will see a problem on homogeneous differential equation. A problem is 4d raised to 4 minus 4d cube minus 23d square plus 12d plus 36 of y equal to 0. The solution. So, uh, I will rewrite once again. So, 4d raised to 4 minus 4d cube minus 23d square plus 12d plus 36 of y equal to 0. Now, so auxiliary equation is means we will convert this all d in terms of m. So, 4m raised to 4 minus 4m cube minus 23m square plus 12m plus 36 equal to 0. So, this is a equation of order 4. Means, we will get 4 roots. But, uh, to simplify, so we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, 5 uh, terms are there. So, we cannot go directly here. So, for this, uh, we will go for a synthetic uh, method. So, to get a root, we will apply synthetic uh, method, division method here. So, by, by synthetic division method, we will see here. Now, in this synthetic division method, first we have to take the coefficient. So, coefficient of m raised to 4 is 4. Coefficient of m cube is minus 4. Coefficient of m square is minus 23. Coefficient of m is 12. And coefficient uh, constant is 36. So, whenever you will go for synthetic division method, it should be in decreasing order. Power, highest power, then less, then less, then less, then less. If it is any power is missing, at that time we have to consider that part as 0. Okay. So, now, so this equation I will type in the calculator. Just see. Because we need to check which number is going to be satisfied. So, we will go for this. So, we will type this equation in terms of M only or uh, any other alphabet. I will take in terms of uh, so this above equation. I will uh, uh, write in, uh, in terms of X. That is 4 alpha X raised to 4 minus 4 alpha X cube then minus 23 alpha x square plus 12 alpha x plus 36. So, I have taken all uh, this uh, equation in, instead of m, I have taken in terms of x, uh, then go for calc option. So, now check with 1. If I put x is equal to 1, I will get answer 0 or no check. We need to check. So, answer is not coming 0 means we will go for one, and the next number. Uh, put x is equal to minus 1 and we will see answer is coming 9. So, that also uh, not a uh, number to satisfy the above equation. Go for calc option. Next, we will go for uh, plus 2. Yeah. Now, if you take a plus 2, if you put x is equal to plus 2 or x is, uh, m is equal to plus 2, so answer is coming 0. It means 2 satisfies the what here uh, e above equation. So, therefore, therefore, so that 2 will take here. Now, we have to take 0. So, 4 plus 0 is 4. So, 4 to the 8. So, minus 4 plus 8 will be 4. So, 4 to the 8. So, minus 23 plus 8 will be. Then, minus 23 plus 8 will be minus 15. So, minus 15 into 2 is minus 30 right here and plus 12 and minus 30 will be minus 18. So, minus 18 into 2 is minus 36. So, plus 36 minus 36 will be 0. So, whenever you choose a number, so if you simply, if you work out this calculation, so last number whatever is there, always it will become 0. So, if it is not turning 0 means you see that what number you have chosen, it is wrong. So, now, so this is a uh, means by quadratic equation converted to what here cubic equation. So, therefore, so therefore, 
so this is the va one value of m so m is equal to 2 and this uh, this is the equation so by quadratic means power 4 become out here power 3 so this is nothing but 4 m cube plus 4 m square minus 15m this is a constant 18 equal to 0 so for this we can use a calculator and get the solution or else you can go for the same synthetic method and you can get it so we'll go for the better uh, calculator option and we'll get the roots here so we'll see how to get uh, means by using the calculator what are the roots we'll check now then mode option 5 then fourth option is cubic equation then coefficient of m cube is 4 coefficient of m square is 4 then coefficient of m is minus 15 constant is minus 18 so equal to sign see the values of m here so here from this we will get first value of m is 2 next second value is minus 3 by 2 next value we are not getting so it means so second value what we got minus 3 by 2 it is repeated because from this we got uh, we want 3 I will show here in the calculator once again you press equal to time so first root is getting 2 I have taken second root it is getting minus 3 by 2 we needed x3 also but if you press equal to sign it is not coming it means so the minus 3 by 2 what we got it as a second root it is again repeated one more time so it is minus 3 by 2 itself the total 1 2 3 4 the total 4 roots so you can observe here so roots are in a pairwise repeated so therefore the i will write down the roots of auxiliary equation are m equal to 2 and 2 next minus 3 by 2 and minus 3 by 2 so these two two roots are repeated here real and coincident so two two pairs okay so just see how to write a complementary function thus yc is equal to for the first two so we have to write c1 plus c2 x into e raised to 2 x so first two we have to write like that then plus so this remaining two so uh, we have taken order so c1 over c2 over then we will go for c3 plus c4 x because it is repeated so c3 plus c4 x into e raised to minus 3 by 2 into x so this is a complementary function so with the help of complementary function we can go for the general solution so the general solution is y is equal to yc which is nothing but y is equal to c1 plus c2 x into e raised to 2 x plus c3 plus c4 x into e raised to minus 3 by 2 x so this is a required general solution of given homogeneous differential equation